let's talk it out. Nip slip. <laughs> now, as the tens and tens of you know, um, I just moved here, and so uh, my issue is that I don't really have any furniture. I have my bed, um, I have my midget, and uh, if midget is offensive, I can't. anyway. So I, I honestly don't have like any way to keep anything off the floor and organized. So my entire wardrobe is now uh, like fixed. But basically, I just kind of like would wear the clothes and just throw them on the floor. But I really need like a like a dresser and a nightstand and a. Uh, like another midget just to kind of help me keep things in order and you know so I need them to sleep under my bed with the monsters because the monster in my bed is really lonely uh, she goes by the name Lady Gaga Anyhow, so what's going on is basically um this week I found a freaking seven foot tall um uh what's it called shelf bookshelf because I have a million books and you know I'll just show you everything I'll just show you the finished product but basically what happened is um, it was very it was too large to fit and <clears throat> let me just walk you through it now. Um, now as you can see behind me, I'm trying to get it into my room and uh, my door is not as tall as the shelf and uh, yeah, did not think this through. Yeah, I'm not known for thinking anything through. I do. Okay, yeah, yeah. Relax, ladies. I'm not that strong. It's just sliding. But I can't seem to freaking get it. It's so stupid tall. Alright, so what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna take it apart. So I got my handy dandy sc screwdriver. And we're just gonna wreak some havoc. Kill me. Okay, I did it. I got it in here. That's how it moves. <laughs> this is my life. This happens all the time. Oh, there's a fan in the way. <laughs> I hate this. Oh, okay. I'm laughing because I know people are going to watch this. And I can't like take a break because this is gonna lean and fall on the fan. And oh god, oh god, okay. and pull. <laughs> Where did these go? Okay, we're done. And here is the finished product. So here is my friends, my John Bavir. These are all movies, all movies. And then these are concert DVDs and GQ boobs, Jane Jackson's boobs. And then there's Maroon 5. And then over here we have television. And then we have series, like, like trilogies and crap. And then over here we have GQ magazines. Everything behind here is all classical, and then these are my little, little pop albums, so I don't really have a lot anymore. Kind of got rid of them. And then over here is my children's books that um, I used to have with the baby. I still have them, apparently. 
and my dictionary. Hmm. And then there's my what is this face? I don't remember the name. So, <clears throat> oh, it feels good to have everything off the floor. Well, anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this week's episode, vlog or so, or I don't know what to call it. Um, uh, next week we're going to be talking about um, how to recover from a one night stand. Basically, I'm making fun of people who sleep around. <laughs> so, if you're one of those, skip next week. Do it. Skip that. There we go. Yes, we didn't have Jewel on for this week because she said no. I'm not going to make my friends do anything that they don't want to do. So Do you want to see my impression of a girl taking a picture? <laughs> hey, Starlet.